Thank you for choosing Kaspersky Lab products and support. In this video, we'll resolve the black.lst corrupt signature database issue. You may receive an error, such as a file black.lst missing or corrupted. This occurs from time to time if your system has been shut down during an update process. To rectify this issue, the recommended method to solve this problem is to initially run the updater. Click on Updater in the message if it's still open. Otherwise, go to the Kaspersky Antivirus console and run it directly from there. This process may take a while as the entire database is being downloaded again. If you receive the Not All Components Were Updated message, simply run the updater one more time. Once the update completes successfully, the issue is resolved. However, in certain circumstances, this may not complete the update. In those cases, we need to manually delete the basis folder and then relaunch the update. Before we're able to manually delete the basis folder, we'll have to make sure the Kaspersky antivirus application is not running. On the machine having the issue, browse to the system tray, find the Kaspersky icon, right click and select exit. If this is being prevented because of an administration kit policy, go to the admin kit. Under the appropriate group, find the client computer you're having the issue with. Double click on the client computer. Browse to the applications tab, select Kaspersky antivirus, right click and stop. Once the application is inactive, you'll be able to manually delete the basis folder. Let's find and delete the contents of the basis folder. In a Windows 7 environment, this is typically located under C program data. Double click Kaspersky Lab Browse to AVP60MP4. Browse to the Bases folder. Select Control A. Right click and delete all the contents. Once the Bases folder has been cleared, simply repeat the steps for downloading updates by relaunching Kaspersky Antivirus and rerunning the Download Updates task. In a Windows XP environment, the folder where the bases are contained is in a different path. Click on Start, Run, and browse to the C Documents and Settings all users, application data, Kaspersky Lab folder. Once again, double click AVP60 MP4, find the basis folder, control A to select all, and delete this selection. Once you have successfully deleted the contents of this folder, simply relaunch the update task. This will re-download all updates including the black.lst file. At the end of the task, your updates will be restored. For additional support options, please contact Kaspersky Lab America's Corporate Support. You can access our knowledge base 24 hours a day, submit a web ticket, chat with a support engineer, or call our support center during normal hours of operation. Thank you for choosing Kaspersky Lab.